Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Rondo back here for another video and today we're gonna be doing another tier list We're gonna be um, pretty much ranking all the battle royale games. I haven't played all of them But I haven't played um, a good amount of battle royales and I do have a general idea of battle royales And I guess what makes them good pretty much this is gonna be an opinion based list So take everything I say with you know a grain of salt are opinions only you know you guys can comment down below what you guys rank these battle royale games but yeah let's just get straight into the tier list oh and uh shout out to my boy jose for uh giving me this idea he was like oh bro you should rank battle royales on a tier list thanks man because this is gonna be an interesting one all right so here we got the battle royales this is a 2020 list so i don't think it's counting a 2021 um battle royales i don't recall any battle royales that came out this year in 2021 but these are the main battle royales right here that we're looking at warzone apex blackout fortnite h1z1 minecraft hunger games uh realm royale and PUBG. and yeah these are the battle royales so we got how many we got here we got about eight battle royales right here so yeah we're gonna start off from left to right and we're gonna go ahead and rank so let me change around the ranks on a tier list just so i can make them unique on my own all right so we got our uh <laughs> list right here godly good all right uh fun sometimes okay and shit or just never played so what i mean by you know this one right here with all right fun sometimes there i worded it better all right can be fun sometimes there we go <laughs> since i worded it so simple that way it made it look weird all right fuck it let's just go man so we're gonna start off with warzone Warzone is a battle royale made by, you know, Activision, um, pretty much the parent company to um, Infinity Ward, Treyarch, and Sledgehammer. Um, it was Infinity Ward that created Warzone for Call of Duty, and uh, Warzone is a really fun battle royale to play. I played it a lot, I've streamed it quite a few times, I made a couple videos on my Frictions channel, so I really do think it's a pretty dope battle royale. I played it quite a bit, and I still play to this day here and there. You know what I mean? So I would say Warzone is a good battle royale. What keeps Warzone, in my opinion, from being godly is the fact that it has so much hackers and it has quite a few issues with the game that's really putting it off right now um, in today's time. The fact that it has hackers, the fact that they're having trouble, you know, fixing bugs in their game and it's just, they try to get on it, but I feel like they're not going hard enough on what they need to do. Because it's really pushing away some of the big streamers to play other battle royales or just other games in general. So that's not a good thing. Apex is a battle royale I think that released about two years ago. Uh, maybe a year ago or over a year ago. But it's a more newer one. And I do think Apex Legends is a really good one. I love playing Apex. Recently it's been popping off. Uh, since Warzone has been slacking, Apex has been picking up the pace for battle royales. So right now, Apex Legends is popping off. I love playing Apex. I think it's a really good battle royale to play. And uh, I just enjoy it, you know. Most of these, I think all of these battle royales are free. So I just find it interesting um, about these, you know, genre of games, you know, being free. But uh, the fact that Apex has uh, a pretty good, solid game overall. I mean, it's not like they have a crazy amount of bugs like Warzone. They don't have hackers like that. Uh, is what's really putting it on a map right now and what's pushing it ahead of warzone right now so for now i leave apex legends in the godly tier for now only because it's doing so well um it's blown up before and it's blowing up again as a you know really popular battle royale to play so i really do think apex is up there next we got blackout right here i'm gonna put blackout in the all right can be fun sometimes the reason why i'm not putting blackout in okay or shit is because blackout started something new for you know call of duty without blackout there wouldn't be a war zone in my opinion blackout was the first battle royale that call of duty has ever tried doing and it was produced by um treyarch themselves and um yeah i do think blackout in some aspects was you know pretty fun but for the most part it wasn't like you know that good of a battle royale it did have its major flaws but overall i do think that uh, blackout did have some of its moments and I thought it was dope that Call of Duty did the first Battle Royale ever. I thought it was awesome. But uh, Warzone took over the reins over Blackout. Warzone's probably going to be the long-running Battle Royale that Call of Duty is going to continue updating continuously. Um, sadly, that Blackout's going to die out now. So um, I put it in the all right can be fun sometimes. Only because Blackout started something huge for Call of Duty. you know. But technically, it should be in the shit tier list or... It should be in a shit tier, my bad. I don't know why I said this. But anyways, moving on to the next one. We got Fortnite right here. Fortnite is a good battle royale. Or even godly. 
because Fortnite, I can't deny what Fortnite has done. I really can't deny what Fortnite has done. When Fortnite released about three years ago, you know, I started playing. I was one of the newer and more, um, I guess, one of the more OG people to play Fortnite. I started playing Fortnite about one or two months after it came out. And a few months before, it completely blew up as a very, very popular game. And I can say that Fortnite has done a lot for the genre of uh, Battle Royale games. I think Fortnite just deserves the godly because of everything that they have done. They have made careers. They have blown up the Battle Royale genre. They changed the landscape of gaming. It brought in, like, I guess pretty much, like, it being free. It being updated all the time. And it just getting major updates. So, yeah, nah, I think Fortnite just takes the godly tier. You know, just based on influence. Right now, Fortnite might not be in the best position. As its popularity has gone down recently by a lot. Right now, Apex is really, really popping off. I think right now, Warzone still is more popular than Fortnite, but... I'm just not going to deny what Fortnite has done. You know what I mean? I just think Fortnite is just up there in that godly tier. I don't play it anymore. It's been, I think, a few months to a year since I played it. I deleted it. I personally don't enjoy the game like I used to. But for the time that I did play, before it was even a famous game, you know, I enjoyed it. I really did enjoy Fortnite in the old days. And, uh, you know, I really did play up until the new chapter started. Chapter 2 just isn't my thing, but... I mean, it is what it is. We got H1Z1. I never played it, so I can't give my opinion on it. Um, all I can say about H1Z1 is that H1Z1 and PUBG are these two battle royales that I've seen way before for Apex, Warzone, or Blackout. I, I would say that these two battle royales give inspiration that are battle royales that are popular and are really up there right now. You know what I mean? H1Z1 and PUBG aren't as played as much as they were before. Because right now, Warzone and Apex and, you know, I guess Fortnite still... Um, these are just three big battle royales are just everybody's playing you know what I mean people don't play h1z1 like that PUBG like that but these are the battle royales that I would say I think influence the genre in general and gives you know studios an idea what to base their game off from and how you know uh, battle royale should be but I never played h1z1 and I never played PUBG so I'm not gonna give an opinion on where I should you know rank them on the tier list Minecraft Hunger Games I never played Minecraft Hunger Games but I think Minecraft Tugging Games was uh, the first Battle Royale, technically. I don't, I don't fucking know. I don't know. Realm Royale is okay. <laughs> it was a weird time playing Realm Royale because, like, I don't know. It was like a Battle Royale that came out of nowhere. People were just playing it for no reason. It was not... I think more or less people played Realm Royale as a joke rather than it being like a new crazy Battle Royale that everybody wanted to play. I think it was more of a joke more than anything. So yeah, Realm Royale is funny. Um, it's, it's technically shit. Yeah, yeah. Realm Royale is shit. I would put all these in the okay or the alright, but Realm Royale is legit shit. Like, there's nothing special about it. The only fun thing I would say about Realm Royale is when you die, you turn into a chicken. So I, I think that's hilarious. Fortnite, Apex are godly right now. Warzone is good. It could be godly, but only if they fix their fucking game. Uh, Blackout is just what they use to get to Warzone. You know, Blackout's just gonna die out with time. You know what I mean? I never played a Minecraft Hunger Games, PUBG, or H1Z1, but uh, I definitely won't deny that they probably are good Battle Royales. You know what I mean? I just never played it, so I'm gonna leave it in the okay, so I'm gonna backlash and sh Realm Royale shit. Alright, so if you guys did enjoy this video, drop a like, subscribe, tell me what you guys think about the tier list, how would you guys rank these Battle Royale games, and uh, comment down below, you know, if you guys did enjoy, share this video out with your friends once again, and thank you guys so much for the support, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.